everybody, this is Zoe from No Safer Place. Today is a video that has been really highly requested recently and one that I'm really excited to share because who doesn't love sharing their bad reading habits? We all have them, we can't deny it, so I'm going to be telling you my top six bad reading habits. Number one, skim reading. I do this all the time, especially if I'm really really enjoying a book and I want to get to the end really really fast, I just want to know what's happening. So I will just read certain words or certain sentences, if it seems important I'll read it, if it's dialogue I'll probably skip it or just read one or two words from it just to try and get the general idea of what's going on. That's why with favourite books I usually have to reread them because I haven't read most of it the first time. It really is terrible and probably my worst habit. But sometimes a book's just too good, you just don't have time to read words. Number two, reading more than one book at a time. This is a new one for me, I never used to do this, it used to really confuse me, I used to get the books messed up in my head, they just used to all merge as one. But I was very much, you cannot start another book until you have finished that one. That seems to have changed, I'm reading about six different books at the moment, I have no idea what's going on in them, I'm super super confused, so I'm just going to probably have to start them all again, which is just one big waste of time. I know that some people can read more than one book at a time and not get confused, but I'm not one of those people. Number three, too many books on your TBR. I'm sure this is one that every single one of you watching has on your bad reading habits list. You go into a bookshop, you know you already have 50 books at home that you need to read. You see a book, you see a shiny cover, you buy it anyway. And when you're going in a few bookshops a week or browsing online a few times a week, that equates to a hell of a lot of new books on your TBR. I have about 20 new books on my TBR a month. Number four, agreeing to review too many books and saying that you'll take part in too many blog tours. This one is pretty much for bloggers only and I wouldn't really say it's a bad reading habit. Being over ambitious, especially when you're a blogger, is really really dangerous. I know that accepting to review too many books puts me in a reading slump, but I continue to do it anyway. I hate saying no to people, especially if it's an author I really like or a publisher I really like. So I just say yes, just yes, I'll review this book. Yes, I'll review that book. Do I have time to review those books? No. I do keep up to date, but it makes things super, super stressful and I wish I didn't do it. Number five, reading ahead. In particular, to the last page. I don't know what this is, and I don't know if it's just me, but if it's a book I really, really like, or one that I've been really anticipating, and it's the final of a trilogy, and I can't wait to read it, I'll just turn to the last page and see what happens. Which can be very, very dangerous. I have done this with so many books before, and just been like, what have I just read? what happens in this book, it is the most awful thing and I can't stop myself doing it, I know that I hate it, I know that it will ruin the book for me, but can I stop myself? No. I think one of the worst times was when the last book in the Half Bad trilogy came out and I was so excited, I could not wait to read this book. Spoiler alert coming for the Half Bad trilogy if you haven't read the series. I read the last few pages, the whole series was ruined. He turned into a tree. Nothing will ever make me angrier than that ending. I had fallen in love with this character for three books. It was incredible. I was so excited for this finale. I couldn't wait to see what was on the last page. And he was a tree. You'd think that that would stop me reading ahead, that one tragic incident where I threw the book across the room and then refused to read it for a few days. But no, I still continue to do it. Number six, rereading favourites. Have 50 books on your TBR? Need to read two books by the end of a week for a blog tour or a book review? What do I do? I reread After the Fire, of course. I've read it 10 times. Do I need to read it in 11th? No. Will I be reading a new book that I need to read? Yes. No, I get After the Fire out, The Bone Season, The Mime Order, Dracula, and read them again. Because why read new books when you can read old ones that you've read a hundred times? And that is it. Those are my six bad reading habits. I'm sure that there are loads more, and I would love to know what your bad reading habits are. I want to feel less guilty about mine, so if you could leave yours in the comments below 
that would be really appreciated. I hope you all have enjoyed this video. Let me know what you would like to see more of on my channel and I hope to see you all again soon. Thank you. Bye.